Here, the people rule. Power can't be taken or asserted. It flows from the people. And it's their will that determines who will be the President of the United States and their will alone. And now, after a long night of counting, it's clear that we're winning enough states to reach 270 electoral votes needed to win the presidency. I'm not here to declare that we've won, but I am here to report when the count is finished, we believe we will be the winners. So once this election is finalized and behind us, it'll be time for us to do what we've always done as Americans, to put the harsh rhetoric of the campaign behind us, to lower the temperature, to see each other again, to listen to one another, to, he to hear each other again, and respect and care for one another, to unite, to heal, to come together as a nation. I know this won't be easy. I'm not naive. Neither of us are. I know how deep and hard the opposing views are in our country on so many things. But I also know this as well. To make progress, we have to stop treating our opponents as enemies. We are not enemies. What brings us together as Americans is so much stronger than anything that can tear us apart. So let me be clear. I, we are campaigning as Democrats, but I will govern as an American president. Every vote must be counted. No one's going to take our democracy away from us. Not now, not ever. America's come too far. America's fought too many battles. America's endured too much to ever let that happen. We, the people, will not be silenced. We, the people, will not be bullied. We, the people, will not surrender. My friends, I'm confident we'll emerge victorious.